Hey everyone, check it out. It's a bit too long for metal detecting here, but I'm gonna do a bit of weed whacking and uh, dig a little hole and see if I can find any bottles today. Um, I've been probing around. I've sort of walked through to find a little spot. I'll start uh, clearing away and um, see what I can find today. See you in a bit. Oh, I just threw out my first thing, look. Oh, it's a little paste jar. Yeah, uh, not that early, obviously, but we're just starting, so. It's a good sign, though, that there's a dumpage here. It's quite a nice shape, actually. It's like the old Victorian um, candle holders, isn't it, a little bit? But for meat or fish. <laughs> anyway, I'll crack on. So we got something here. I think it's going to be a clear sauce bottle. Oh, that's annoying. Hang on a sec. Oh no, sauce bottle. Well, yeah, it's a sauce bottle, but it's like the shape of a hose, hose sauce, isn't it? But it doesn't have it on the, maybe it's a later one where they did it in paper. What's the lip saying? I think that's an applied top. Yeah, it is. That's pretty good age then. Oh, I'm happy with that. I'll carry on. Oh, it's a hot one today. I'll see how long I last. I got quite a lot of water with me, but it is hot. And I got my trousers on because I don't want to get cuts on my knees. Um, anyway, for those of you who have joined me in the last year or two, uh, you've probably seen me metal detecting, but this channel actually started off as bottle digging during the pandemic. I lived in Wales, South Wales, in an old, old mining village, and I came across a dump and got into it that way. So yeah, if you're enjoying, going to enjoy this video, why not check out my older bottle digging videos? I found some pretty cool stuff, you know, cod bottles, poisons, all that lot. Um, but yeah, hopefully, if this dump turns out to be good, maybe I'll do a few more. Um, but yeah, anyway, I'll see you when I find a few more bits. <laughs> so, it's an old barrel. I've just come up uh, into the hedgerow uh, by the road, and look, probably have better luck up here, to be honest. Looks like something's dug there, dug some stuff out. Um, gonna have a little route around here, I think. See what there is. That's the top of a cod bottle, so I'm in the wrong place. So, yeah, let's see what there is here anyway. Probably should check in the barrel, shouldn't we? See you then. Mm, nope. <laughs> Worth a try now, wasn't it? Looking like a broken beer. Let's see what we could have won. Ah, Royston. Something brewery, Royston. I'm going to take that and cut it down. We can have a little Royston tea light thingy. Put it in my Etsy shop. There's a bit more of it there, look. Hmm, wonder why there would have been. Bits of, there's loads of bits in here. I'm going to dig through this today, so it's nice to get out of the sun as well. Excellent. Oh, that would have been a lovely colour. Bit of a ding on the lip. Maybe I'll take it anyway. Maybe I could do something with that. Really nice colour. There you go. See a bit better now, can't you? I wasn't expecting to find one of them here. I uh, don't really find them with my metal detector so iron, but it's not a very big one. Medium size, I'd guess. But yeah, cool. We Ah, oh, that would have been a beautiful flask. I wonder what it was, something Cambridge. Limited. Ah, oh, there's got to be some whole stuff here, surely. I think this little mound here is all little dumpage area, so... I'll just get a little sauce down here. Little burst lip one. Very nice. Sign of a flag in there. I keep getting um, bits of cod here, look. So there's a few bits, another bottle there, but yeah, it's hard going. All right, it's probably your first signs of uh, maybe a whole bottle here, look. 
Nope. So just a little wine one anyway. Very shallow. Just a little medicine with a thick ass base. Look at that. It says something around the top, but I can't quite make it out. I'll put it up on the screen if I can figure it out. I don't think it's Mason's extract. Looks like something else. It's got a little ding in the lip though. Check it out. That's the best harmonica reed I've ever found. And it wasn't even metal detecting. Obviously the little the reeds for the different notes would have gone on here. It would have blown on it. But yeah, harmonica reeds. Oh, that's close, look. We got a cud. It's quite a lot of embossing on that. Let's give it a rub. Pure mineral waters. Robson and Sons. Saffron Walden. There you go. Quite a local one. I'm going to take that. Cut it down. Oh, yes. Looking like a giant pickle here, right by the surface. We're out. There it is. Nothing on it, but still a nice little pickle, isn't it? Always useful. Got a nice wide, drippy lip there, look. Oh, almost dropped it. There you go. A whole thing. <laughs> Check it out. It's like a little milk. Don't think there's anything on it. It's quite cute though, isn't it? I'm guessing it's like some sort of milk or cream. Probably cream, actually. Ugh. I think this is a good little spot here. At least I'm getting whole stuff now, so... Yes, very good. Check it out. It's like a little keg tap. Tap bit's missing, but the like filtery bit is there, so it weighs a ton. But yeah, cool. So we got some in here. Oh, Cambridge Lemonade. That's pretty cool. Chivers and Sons, Liston, Cambridge. There you go. Nice. I think that's my favourite find so far today. And there's a thing here, look. What's that? Is that just going to be a top? I'm just going to dig that out because uh, it's stuck in there. Looks like we've got a bunch of stuff here, look. Oh, I'll try and get this one. Oh, that's a beast. But there's nothing on it. It's really uh, interesting shape though. Look at that. Such a weird shape. I like it. What's this one gonna be? But it's gonna be just a wine or something. Oh, sorry for the shaking. Oh. Yeah, just a wine. Oh, feeling we're getting close to something embossed here. Let's carry on. There's mosquitoes everywhere. Check that out. Oop, oop. Any ideas what that was? Pretty cool. I think it's glass. Yeah, it's got to be glass. Very decorative anyway. Hmm. Oh, check this out. Um. <laughs> Another cool metal thing that I didn't find metal detecting is a mud, I think it's a mud pattern. So this would have clipped onto the bottom of a shoe and you could walk on the mud with it, not get your shoes dirty. So I think that's what that is. Yeah, interesting. Check this out. This looks really old. Some sort of cork bottle. Let's pop her out. I think it's whole. Oh, it is. Yeah, that looks really old. I think this might be the one. <laughs> Williams Late Peacock. Gwynn Street. Bedford. Trademark. Limited. Oh, that's 
got a picture on it. Nice. There's a hand holding the bottle. Oh, that is amazing. That is so early. Oh, that is lovely. I'm absolutely, this has made the dig for me. Oh, I can't wait to clean that one up. I was just about to sort of call it a day, but I might just do this little bit now. Excellent. You know what? I think I'm going to end on a high there. I could come back here again. No, it is now. And while I was filling in my hole in the gravel pit, I did find a bit of cold in there, so I think I might need to try there again when it's a bit less overgrown. He said he was going to cut it, but maybe I'll give him a little reminder, but I'll show you what I found today anyway. So, broken cud. Still going to take that. There's two horseshoes in the end. There's one in there and one there. A uh, bit more card, get rid of that. Oh, there's a little statue thing. Pretty busted. A few little bottles. Big old pickle. Little milk thingy. That was pretty cool. It's probably my second favourite find of the day. Cambridge lemonade. That's not bad. No chips or anything. Doesn't look like. Uh, I found a little lid. I think it's a St Helens one. Yeah. Cannington Shaw. Um, there's big old things. Don't think I'm going to take the wine bottle. I'll probably take that one though. And this, absolute beaut. It's sick as a anything, you know. But I love it. <laughs> I quite like the sick ones, you know, because it, if you put some lights in there, it just sort of gives it a gentle glow. That is old. Yeah, I'm looking forward to that anyway. I'll, I'll do a little clean up at the end, but yeah, definitely fine of the day. Well, it makes it worth coming out. I'm just going to rake it all in back in and uh, make it a bit more safe and then yeah stick around for the cleanup. I'll uh, try and uh, remember how I do the, the ones for the bottle digging because it's been about two years now so yeah anyway hope you guys have enjoyed that. If Let me know in the comments if you um, want to see a bit more bottle digging or nah it's boring. Um, but yeah anyway I'll catch you guys next time. Cheers. Ooh.